Well, here I am at Fresh International Market in Schaumburg. This is a new store. It opened in May, and here it is uh, close to the end of June. So it's been about two months since this store has been running. And I have to say that I'm very impressed with how clean this place looks. Now, of course, it is a new location, and that, of course, adds a lot to the cleanliness, I'm sure. Now, if they can keep this level of cleanliness up, they're gonna stand out compared to other Asian markets. If you get a chance to come out here, I would definitely do so just to take a look at the uh, variety of uh, foods that's available uh, in the grocery section. But of course, there's other things too. As you can see here, uh, there's prepared food. And I believe this market is more geared as Chinese rather than some of the Korean markets out there. And there's also, uh, of course, Mitsuo, which is uh, more Japanese oriented. But you can get a whole bunch of different uh, varieties of Asian foods here, not just Chinese food. But uh, it does seem like the food court is more geared towards Chinese. Now you have a lot of different type of meats that are available. You can get uh, meats that, uh, you know, just the butcher will make for you and you can get prepared and prepackaged type meats. But uh, you have a variety. If you're into things like hot pot, eh, it's a lot of things here. The fish section is also very clean too. Uh, surprisingly, it doesn't smell fishy. <laughs> now it could be that it is new and we don't smell any of that uh, going on, but um, hopefully in time, it stays that way. Uh, frogs, yes, <laughs> those were frogs. So if you're into frog legs, definitely there's, there's an opportunity for you to get uh, live frogs there. So things that we might not see that often here in the suburbs, uh, it's now available here. And that's a good and surprising thing. Um, the standard things, fish balls um, are available. The prepackaged frozen goods are available. Uh, and I had an opportunity to read some of the various uh, responses on Yelp. And it seems like a lot of the Yelp reviews we're really geared towards when the store first opened on a soft opening. I, I don't know whether that's really fair to give uh, that type of review um, when it's that new. Uh, things are being worked out. Uh, shelves weren't fully stocked yet, but uh, it's been two months, so things are a little bit different. Um, I'm sure that uh, things are more in place and staff is running better. Staff that I talked to were very nice. They, they were very accommodating. I actually asked if it was okay for me to go ahead and record this for everyone to see. And um, although they were a little hesitant at first, uh, probably because they didn't know my channel, um, they were very accommodating and they were very nice about it. So um, yeah, it's something that's gonna help them if it's out there and it's definitely gonna help my channel too. So would I recommend this place to you? Absolutely. I would definitely go there and take a look at it. It is probably the cleanest Asian shop around right now. And I would say uh, the variety is definitely there. Uh, prices, eh, okay, you know, that's, that's up to you. But it is convenient, and that's, I think, a key to why people come to stores like this out here in the suburbs rather than going all the way down to Chinatown. So if you're interested in something like this, come out and check out Fresh International Market. Definitely worth the while to take a look at it. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button and definitely hit the subscribe button. And after you do that, hit the bell icon. That'll give you notifications when new videos are available for me. And share this with your friends. Let them see what's out there in the suburbs and come out and take a look at this uh, new grocery store. Talk to you guys later.